Thank you very much for your today's presentations. And uh, I would like to have a couple of information and uh, what you will, what will happen actually in the in the forthcoming three months. As I mentioned at the very beginning today morning, that there were 100 applicants and 83 students started to work with us, and currently 74 of them are still with us. Uh, unfortunately or fortunately, it depends on which side we are looking at, we uh, uh, had to say farewell for nine students because they didn't reach the expected stage uh, of going forward, and we will keep it uh, continuously. Concerning the second year, students currently from the 91 students we have 74 who reached the complex exam which means that approximately within two years 20 percent of the students stuck uh, at some place but i am absolutely pleased that due to your uh, today's presentation we could reach actually the forthcoming three months but you have to keep going your activity, as I referred at the very beginning of the morning, that success can come only if you multiply knowledge with activity. And the forthcoming three months will not be easier than the last three months. However, I also refer that this is your golden year. It means that now you have four days to be off from science, from healthcare work, but you can concentrate on your scientific uh, development. From next year, you will have only one science day, which means that you will not be able to go as fast as currently. So in the forthcoming uh, 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 three months, you, like last year, you will have the opportunity to meet really distinguished top researchers. Last year, also, everybody could have a chance to meet Nobel laureates and distinguished lecturers. We just confirmed today that there will be also seminar lecturer from uh, the dentistry group, which who will come uh, also in May. You most probably received the invitation today. However, in the forthcoming three months, you really need to focus writing up your papers. Most of you have the completed results or will need to have the completed results, but you have to reach this level. And if you reach it, most probably you will be able to have the two articles in a year one. It means you will have a much relaxful year two for uh, the next uh, year. Of course, three months later, you also need to stay here, to stand here, and you have to show what you could achieve and to get the ticket for the fourth three months, which currently, I must say, like in earlier, is not granted. So if you go forward, you will go for the fourth phase. If you don't do what is expected, you will not be able to continue. I am more than happy to, to see that one of the best example for translational medicine, Bruce Butler will come this weekend. Those who have already registered, they will have the special privilege to spend one hour with him, uh, actually in Szeged. Uh, he's actually received the Nobel Prize for discovering the toll-like receptors, which currently the target of the biological therapy. So all immunology and all biological active therapy currently available in medicine because of his discovery. So science can change a lot. Science can change people's life. And he's one of the best examples how to translate scientific knowledge back to patients' benefit. Those who missed currently to register it, don't worry. In December, there will be another two Nobel laureates coming to Hungary. Of course, exactly the same way you will get actually an uh, information beforehand and you need to register to attend the meeting. Of course, we not only have scientific programs, but we have social programs. One of the, no, I, I can say that habits is the, which started even in page on the very first year is the challenge day, which is a, 
cycling tour around the lake of Balaton and the challenge is that we do it within one day. So if somebody would like to join in, more than welcome to join in. Of course, who can't go through, there are plenty of comps available on the Balaton, but this is really, really a very nice program. And we also will have a so-called translational medicine house dance evening, which I also can suggest those who would like to attend. Of course, there are other sports activities will be there, like the Vivichita, which is actually, I don't need to mention, uh, at the dentistry group that your dean is also very, very active in the running field. I mentioned at the very beginning that motivation is really not everything because it's good to start, but you need commitment. And I also mentioned at the very beginning my vision, my mission, but I haven't mentioned my commitment. So and my commitment to assist you, actually to help you to find a way to translate scientific knowledge back to patients' benefits. And this is your choice in the, your later phase, how much from this knowledge you will actually use from it. I still, after this today's progress reports, I still feel myself committed. So I will attend the group meetings and will continuously use my friendly fires during the meeting. So, thank you. I also thank very much to Akos Nagy for the long journey from the University of Page and his endless support of translational medicine even started from 2016. So, thank you for being with us. And also, there is a time concerning our innovation to celebrate those who received the excellent questionnaire prize. So I would like to ask Rita Nagy to help me. Those who received the prize, please stay here outside because you will also get the excellent questionnaire certificate and the wine, and there will be a photography as well. First, Martin Rakovic. And please stay here as well for a group photo. Balin Gellert. <laughs> Bettina Budai. <laughs> Eddie Natari. Marton Sapados, Erika Kolumban, Agnes Ester Timár, Shoci Kávási, Mónika Lipp, Laura Tolkien. Zsuzsa Nagy. Vivi Unger. And let, 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 let's give two bottles in that case. If you have two, yes, it's okay. Yeah. Renata Kishmiki. <laughs> Petrana Martinakova. <laughs> Jakub Hoferika. Donny, uh, Donny Bednarik. Sometimes we miss the, uh, the uh, counting the questions. Is there anybody in the audience? We miss the three questions. 
but nobody stays sit. I can sing. So, Rita, if you go to the middle and we can have a group photo of the best questioners. Martin Arch for the excellent question and certificate. Congratulations. Thank you for your question. <laughs> Bori Körmendi. Okay, so she is not here. She got the certificate and we will drink the wine. So Nikki Kish. Dilan Markarim. Thank you. And Dilan, we received two prizes as well because the volunteer certificate also, he was helping us during uh, the today's program. Isabel Pinto Amorim Das Virgens. Martin Pop. After receiving the student prize, we received the excellent questionnaire prize. So you need a big bag to go home. David Balog, thank you for your questions. And also thank you for the help of uh, Rihard Massi. He is here. Put the mic down and you can have the wine up. Thank you. This time, however, today there were I was so happy to see so many students, so we couldn't record well who had three questions during the day. However, therefore, I would like to ask to stand up those who had three questions at least today. Please stand up, everybody who had three questions. Yes, yes, go on, don't be shy those who had three questions, because I would like to ask Fanny Mesnerich to help me to deliver the prize for you. And uh, actually, you will get the certificate later, but you can then drink the wine earlier. So I think the most important part of the prize will be delivered. So please uh, uh, come over, please, or she. And also come, come to the middle as well. Okay, Diana, please, Diana, come over. And all the other students, please come and take the, take the wine prize. Of course, those who haven't got a bottle will still have an opportunity to cheer in the other room and make a, a toast for the success. And the others will also get uh, uh, actually a, a glass of wine over there, so please, after the meeting, don't rush. Still a couple of glasses of wine and some food available for you. So give a, a applause for the team.